Security Guard Ultra was designed with one purpose in mind, to extend the lifetime of your column without altering chromatographic results. Hi, welcome to Phenomen XLC Lab. Installing your Security Guard Ultra is very easy. I'm Kevin and I'll be here to guide you through the proper installation so we can all be sure it does what it's supposed to do. Protect your favorite UHPLC, core shell, or sub-2 micron column from contaminants and extends its lifetime. Before we start, let's get familiar with the parts of the Security Guard and what you will need in order to make the proper installation. Your Security Guard Ultra holder is composed of two parts, the tube base and the floating nut. Then we have the Security Guard Ultra cartridge, which is the part you will be replacing later. The Security Guard Ultra cartridge is what keeps the contaminants away from your column. You will be replacing this part once you see a change in your system pressure. In order to install it correctly, you will need one 5 16 inch 8 millimeter wrench to hold the cartridge and a second wrench whose size will depend on the column hardware. For this video, we are using a 3 8 inch wrench. Now, let's begin. First, let's inspect the Security Guard Ultra holder. Inspect the tube base and the floating nut, but do not separate the two pieces that comprise the Security Guard Ultra cartridge holder. Ensure that these two pieces of the holder are completely coupled together. The tube nib should extend beyond the furrow a full 4 millimeters. Next, let's assemble your Security Guard Ultra cartridge to the holder. To avoid contamination, it is important that you avoid touching the cartridge frit. Holding the Security Guard Ultra cartridge from the flat area in the back, attach it to the holder. Turn it in a clockwise direction as far as possible. Now that the cartridge is assembled, you can connect it to your favorite UHPLC, core shell, or sub-2 micron column. Hold the assembled holder cartridge by the flat area and insert the tube nib of the holder straight into your column's end fitting. Using your hands in a clockwise direction, screw the holder cartridge assembly into the column inlet end fitting as far as it will go. The tubing will extend to the appropriate port depth of your column's end fitting. Now, let's tighten these parts together to make sure they're leak free. Place one 5 16 inch or 8 millimeter wrench on the flat area of the Security Guard Ultra cartridge. Place a second wrench on the end nut of the column. Turn the wrench on the Security Guard Ultra cartridge in a clockwise direction. Do not turn the wrench on the column. About 15 psi of torque is sufficient to seat the ferrule of the holder to the column and provide a pressure stability of up to 20,000 psi or 1,378 bar. Be careful not to over tighten as this may cause cartridge and system failure. Didn't I tell you that was easy? Your column is now protected from particulates and contaminants and ready for analysis. Don't forget, this is just one of our helpful tools for Security Guard Ultra installation. You can get more installation tips in the Security Guard Ultra instruction manual or by watching the cartridge replacement and the system installation videos.